In scary obsessed news. Oh. Submitted by Justin from Santa Ana. Santa Ana. Santa Ana. An armed fan targeted YouTubers in their own home. What? Wait, a fan? It hit close to home. He brought a gun to the place? To their home. To the face? See, that's why I've always been saying. Out of love or hate? I, um, <clears throat> both. That's why. I never wanted to reveal my identity. I didn't want to show my address or anything. Well, you did on, already. I know, because I got a lot of guns now, but back then I didn't. That's true. That's <laughs> fair. Yeah, we got an alarm. We got dogs. We got guns. We got Bart. We're good. <laughs> Technically, all you need is Bart. Bart. <laughs> yeah, I think that's pretty good. Yeah. Me, I, I have two kitties. I have a slingshot. <laughs> and I have a Nerf bow. Come at kitties. me, bro. I love kitties. Not even oh, cats. My kitties will fuck you up. My kitties. kitties fuck my arms up all the time. That's why I got fucking <laughs> random scratches all the time. It will fuck me instantly. I'm allergic. That shit will get me. I got a kazoo and I can drop my pants really fast. <laughs> oh. And his pants go, wow. <laughs> Yeah, so YouTubers, uh, their names are Megan Turney and Gavin Free. This is what they look like. Oh. They look like uh, YouTube people. <laughs> <laughs> they do. They. Have I like his sweater. It's pretty awesome. Right? Yeah. They look about yeah, as YouTube so, as it gets. You know the slow-mo guys? <laughs> Uh, I think so. Yes, he, clothing. Yeah, so he, he's part of the slow mo guy. Oh, oh that's oh. why we don't know what he looks like. Oh, yeah, and then she, she does like gaming. Fast mo girl. I would have never guessed. I'm sure they don't know what we look like either. Whatever. Yeah, so. They probably don't know who we are. Watch, they're watching right now, like, I do. Oh, I love you guys. Oh, I guess we do look very white and wear sweaters. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, we were, I was just clowning on a little bit. fine. So. Yeah, so there was this. Crazy obsessed fan. So he was obsessed with Megan, but he hated Gavin. So, because of the fact that Gavin's Megan's boyfriend. Oh, that's what you meant by love hate. Yeah, yeah, love hate. Yeah. He's not good looking enough for her. Oh. So he wanted to Poor take her away. Yeah, Help so her. this guy, his name's Christopher, he drove 11 hours from New Mexico all the way to Austin. That's too long. From oh, Albuquerque shit. to Austin. He's dedicated. What a yeah. dedicated fan. First two hours, done. First two hours. First fucking thought of like driving there. I'm yeah, like, no. So even if really like I really, really, like, I, I'm picturing myself as a crazy person. Two hours in, I'm like, you know, not worth it. You're not picturing yourself as a crazy person enough. Remember that NASA lady who wore diapers and fucking went like oh, yeah. 14 hours in a car and she tracked down her ex and like, what? Tried to kill him, I think. You're, There's a lot of cool stops uh, in the, in between those places. He's we crazy went on a road trip. <laughs> but do you, do you take selfies in that crazy mindset? Where you're like, oh, I'm gonna kill this person. You know, it's right. like time. Your anger disappears. Yeah, yeah. You know? My anger disappears in about two hours too. Yeah. I'll be fucking pissed, and then I'm like, ah, fuck two this. hours? Wow. I like how Joe would be falling for all the tourist traps. He's like, I'm gonna go kill this person, but oh shit, meteor craters in 87 miles. Oh, okay. I do. <laughs> I try to stop. <laughs> I try to stop at every single one. So when me and Jess was road tripping, there's this sign called The Thing. And there's That's like 50 bill billboards. <laughs> the Thing, The Thing, The Thing. And I'm all like, we're gonna go see The Thing. Uh, yeah, and well, they're like, here come more idiots to see The Thing as they see you coming up the yeah. road, you know? It was like a huge gift shop with like a little museum of old collecting things. And then The Thing was just a fake wrapped up mummy. What? <laughs> it was fake? <laughs> How much to get in? Tell me how much it was. It's like to get two in. bucks or something. That's it? Yeah. <laughs> it was like, I, I liked it. I thought it was awesome, but Jess got scared. Jess got she scared got of the thing? No, it was, it was really dark, and then in the middle was like a trailer park, and there was no one there. Oh, it was so, a rapey area. So yeah, it was it was, it looked like a zombie movie. So then she, at the very end there was like noise and stuff. Once you saw the trailer park, you still committed. <laughs> You're like, yep. <laughs> you just yeah. went right through. And it was like just old confirmed it in his head. <laughs> yeah. It was like old cars. Cars and like there was a Bonnie and Clyde car with like blood and people dead and like like gunshots all over. And She's like, I don't know, went. honey. I don't know, honey. And you're like, we're here to see the thing, all right? <laughs> get off, bitch. Yeah, get, get off, right here. No, it was like thriller. Like she was like, ah, and I'm all like, hey. oh, you were the big man. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah, you would've yeah, been really yeah. funny if you just kicked her out and locked the door and just went off. <laughs> oh, that would've been fucked up. <laughs> okay, that's not funny at all then. Right. That's scary. How you have a girlfriend? I don't know. Yeah, I've I've done some pretty dumb stuff in the beginning. I don't do that shit anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I love tourist traps. Yeah, I've learned. Yeah, so back to this here. So they, this is Christopher, by the way. You guys see Lucifer. Oh, yeah. Lucifer. He, looks he looks like, like Ed good. Sheeran. Like yeah, the a little ugly bit. version? Yeah. Looks like he could be my brother. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit, yeah. It does a little. Quite a bit. You guys grow the same facial hair. I'm like a cousin of yours or something. <laughs> yeah. Could, very well could be, yeah. Yeah. So, uh, so the couple, they were woken up at 3.40 a.m. because uh, they heard some glass shatter. Oh, oh shit. shit. Yeah. 
<laughs> Jinx it. Yeah, and then so <clears throat> they ended up hiding in their closet. And while they were hiding in the closet. Both of them? Yeah, the both what? of them. What? So you hear glass shatter? They're, they're, they're like vlogging in there, like, oh my god, you're not gonna believe someone broke it to me. Wait, turn on, how do we turn on night vision? <laughs> how do we monetize this Don't part you of our have life? a protocol when that happens? What? When yeah. somebody breaks in, you have a house protocol, right? Oh yeah, for me, I grab the gun, I run to wherever I hear the noise. All right, that's the protocol. <laughs> I thought it was something way more serious. Joe has a protocol. Act, fir act first, act quickly, and act violently. That's my. What if that's it's my like your dad? Kill, kill, kill. Yep. I know. What if it's someone innocent? You accidentally hurt someone. Oh, you pull the trigger last. You assess oh. the situation. But I, I act first, act quickly, and I act violently as fast as I can. He always grabs the gun. Every if time. I hear the threat, that's it. I'm there in like a second. What if a second's not fast enough? Then I'm, then I'm slow. I'm faster than a second, dude. <laughs> I have no idea. I just said my dogs. That was the dopest karate chop I've ever seen. It started here and it ended here somehow. It's like you're playing drums and shit. It's like you're a kill person. It looked, like you were draw it looked like you were drawing a rainbow. I have killed. I have killed with these hands. You'll see. Yeah, so while they were hiding in the closet, they were calling 911 and you, they could hear him searching for the couple. Oh! And he, they had uh, surveillance footage. That's pretty scary though. He was, he was walking through the home with a gun in his hand ready to kill. Oh shit. Jesus. I know, fucking scary. So then, luckily the cops, so apparently like, he decided to leave, so he ended up going to the driveway. He was about to take off, but then that's when the, the Austin police arrived and they ordered him to stop. Either the cop shot or he shot himself. He died. Christopher oh, died in, no. in the, the drive. This is one of those I, oh, times no. when I feel like, good job, cops. You gotta, Hell yeah. You gotta kill him. Because, they, you know, he's dangerous. Yeah. He's, he, he would drive 11 hours, not even stop at any of the tourist traps. He didn't even see that a thing. crazy. Yeah, that's a lot of discipline. That's crazy. Yeah, and then they also found uh, in searches of his cell phone and stuff that there were various notations identifying both Megan and Gavin by name and further threatening thoughts were recorded wow. by Christopher and directed towards Gavin, Gavin saying things like, I want Gavin free to die alone with no children. Damn. Like, in the fuck? He went there to kill. Dude, no woman is ever worth that trouble, trust me. They're more trouble than they are freedom, so. Yeah, these guys don't know that though. Well, yeah, it's because they've never been in a relationship, oh. so they don't know what a real relationship is like, so all, they just watch all these movies and then they go like, uh, one day I'm gonna love her like nobody else can love her. <laughs> oh, God. Also, they, dude, they never know what a shit show everything is behind the scenes. Yeah. I've known so many YouTubers over the years, dude, and every time I see these, the, the perfect image of the perfect couple and all the perfect- It's usually worse. It's the worst yeah. shit ever, yeah. always. Yeah. It's always the most fucking nightmarish fucking hellscape, like behind the scenes. But people don't know that, they just see like the fucking perfect edit, cause they, you're not gonna leave your argument in the video, like most people oh, cut will. that shit out. <laughs> right, I would too. But these cats, they they. That's because they're not scoundrels like us. <laughs> no, we're scoundrels. We, we went on a tour with some YouTubers in Australia, and some of the ones with the most Disney image are fucking cokeheads. They're asking for coke every venue oh. we're going to, and we're like, what the fuck? You're fucking. Crazy. And they would tell us they were like, hey, uh, the pr the promoters were like, hey, you guys have to tone it down. Oh, right? You guys are fucking edgy. Like, we know what you guys are gonna do on stage. Yeah, you guys we're just like, gotta tone like, it down. Don't, don't do any of that. We're like, we're not going to. We no, this is a church. Of course, I'm not gonna fucking say crazy shit. But that's fucking say crazy shit. shit. Right, but see, but see, and then you come off like, like you know, crazy or whatever. Yeah. To people on, who follow you. Yeah. But but then the, and these people are supposed to be more perfect than you. But they're shit shows. Yeah, they're fucking saying. coke all day. I did a show with um, fucking uh, what's her name? She's fucking she's big now, but she wasn't then. Uh, BB Rexa. She's like this huge artist, right? So literally, they sit me down and they go, Hey, just to let you know, there's kids out in the crowd. Do not curse and just be very mindful. And they were giving me a serious talk. I was like, yeah, I told you, like, I'm, I'm a professional. I don't have to curse. Yeah. Cool, walk out, BB goes in front of me. She goes, sup fucking bitches. <laughs> I was like. <laughs> they always give the wrong warning to the wrong person. Yeah, and they were just oh, looking yeah. at me. I was like, what the fuck? Like, like you're the one that influenced Yeah, you. and she goes, oh, I'm sorry. I'm not supposed to fucking curse, but. <laughs> wow. Anyways. Well, who's ready to fucking rock out? I was like, oh shit. Dude, when Shay Carl went down, like, I look, I like Shay personally, like, a normal long time, but, like, I wasn't crazy surprised because I've, like, like, I remember when, when the videos, like, when he was doing his videos and stuff, like, he has this image thing, but then we all knew that Shay drank and, like, smoked and did stuff, like, so, so hearing this wasn't, like, the nuttiest shit in the world. Yeah. Like, like, that's his image. I didn't, because I don't really watch it. Was this family? Mormon, oh, family guy. Family dad, I don't drink with, with and stuff. Religion so. attached to it, so. So it's even oh, with religion attached. More, like he's a 
Mormon. Mormon, right? So yeah, so the expectation, like the the the, the level that he fell was higher because he it was built up higher. I see. Because the the perception for the audience was just that he was just the perfect dad and all the shit. Yeah, you know what I mean? I think like too, like when you don't you have to air out your laundry before somebody else does. So it's like, for example, let's say like an article came up where I robbed the hostess factory. Like nobody's gonna be like, hmm. <laughs> nobody's gonna be yeah. like, well, how hungry was he at the time? Right, yeah, <laughs> exactly. They're like, well, I hope he gets a lesser sentence. Yeah, they're not gonna, they're not gonna. I do expect him to do this, yeah. My anti-drug is to be opposite. Like, I air out all my shit on camera, and that relaxes me. And when I go home, I'm like a chill person. Mm -hmm. Most of the time. <laughs> <laughs> That's the scariest shit ever, dude. Oh my god, I can see it behind your eyes. Oh, you know what happened? Poor Jess. Hashtag, <laughs> hashtag poor Jess. You know, you know, you know why I love Jess because like she knows how to calm me down. So we got into a big fight the other day, and, and, and um, She's when butt naked. No, no. When I was when I was yelling, come on, baby, when I was, come when on, I was yelling, on. she started recording me, and I was like, blackmail. <laughs> You're recording me right now. You're gonna blackmail me. And I was all like, oh my god, but. It made me love her even more because I'm like, man, you're so smart. Like that would, I, I, no one would ever know how to stop me in my tracks when I when I'm getting in my like my fit and I'm like having my tantrum and I'm yelling. You know that's actually crazy. what Casey and I do with Isaac. You started recording him. Yeah, we're like, we're and did you stop him? We're saving this for the vault, Isaac. Yeah. Once you're older, you're gonna see what you. Because we're obviously we're not gonna be posting that stuff, but like. Does, does it does it work on him? Does he like stop in his tracks? When we were in Japan, he was acting up so much. We remember that trip. So much, and I was just like, Isaac, you're driving me crazy. And so like finally, if, when he just started having a tantrum, I'm like, Casey, start rolling, start rolling right now. And so we're start recording him, and as soon as he sees the camera on, he'll be like. You know what's so funny? And I'm like, you I, wow. Favorite. I would have literally never given a shit. It's like, I'm recording. I don't give a fuck. Record me then. I start going crazy. As, as a kid, I would. Get this as a shit then. Oh yeah. shit, this is really heavy table. <laughs> get this. <laughs> as a kid, I wouldn't give a shit. But as an adult, I'm like, oh fuck, I'm acting yeah. a fool right now. I better call. As a kid, I would just start punching more holes in the wall. Yeah. You want a show? No, but then, <laughs> as, a, as an adult, you're like. Wait up, the world's gonna see how stupid I'm acting like right now. It's true. So let me calm down and talk to you like an adult. <laughs> Have you ever noticed that when you're vlogging in public and stuff, that um, it's it's almost like you're you're like CNN with a camera there and people are coming up in the background like Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't matter how small the camera too. Right? It's like you could even be doing it with your phone and people are like, what is it? What, what are they doing? Especially yeah. in Vegas. Like, they do that even more in Vegas. Right, it's like this isn't a live feed, you idiots. Like it's this fucking is international. We're at the Coliseum in Italy and we're trying to vlog and there's these little fucking Italian girls jumping back and forth like this. <laughs> we're like, this That's is what, happens people, everywhere. They change when they see a camera. It's like the nuttiest shit. It's just yes, yeah, people in the background like. <laughs> Yeah, that was a <laughs> <laughs> Why? Why do you trying to photo bomb? Way? Yeah, yeah. What the fuck? Like, just because it's a camera. Like, everybody that has a camera we're, now. We were doing everyone's this, this food thing with this Vietnamese restaurant, and there's this one dude like just being so fucking obnoxious. I'm just trying to grab a shot of the front of the store, and he's just like, Hey, hey, over here. So I put the camera on him, and he's kind of far away from me. And I was like, All right, continue. What do you want to do? He goes, I just want to say. I was like, All right, fucking loser. There you go, idiot. Keep going. Yeah, <laughs> just. Continually talking shit, he just doesn't know. This is so fucking obnoxious. Like, what's gonna happen? I'm not gonna put this in here, dude. My favorite social media, um, at taking advantage of, of a moment for social media story is during the recent hurricanes. Like, people were taking cameras and going outside oh, dude, and filming it for everybody. And then, and then, like, th there would be live chats of people watching it live because they were broadcast live from their phones. Yeah. And then, anytime the feed cut, everyone would, would, you know, the meme like press F to pay respects? So yeah. They probably died. Yeah, right. <laughs> Right, because there's some game where I guess you press F and you pay respects to somebody. So as soon as the camera cuts out, because it was like crazy fucking hellstorm outside, right? So as soon as the camera cuts out, you would see the chat and just say F, 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 F. <laughs> Like that shit was amazing, but people were taking advantage of this moment to try to get like a little bit of Famous. social media juju, exactly. Yeah. Oh, that would be so awesome just to see the camera and you're like, how's this guy in the air? He died. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that would be crazy if it's in the hurricane. Yeah, that would be dope. Shh.